Frank Zappa is a very interesting one. His dad was a chemical warfare engineer, initially assigned to the Edgewood Arsenal, um, which was not only the home base, uh, longtime home base of U.S. chemical warfare research, but has been implicated uh, repeatedly in various uh, unclassified MK Ultra documents as a hotbed of MK Ultra research as well. Mm. And um, yeah, his dad, uh, Frank Zappa, was actually born <laughs> at the Edgewood Arsenal. Uh, the family lived in, uh, in um, housing right there on the base. He went to the Edgewood School, you know, I mean, for, he lived the first seven years of his life within the confines of the Edgewood Arsenal, was born, raised, and educated there for the first seven years of his life, uh, which is a pretty curious, you know, background for, for, a, yeah, for really. a rock star to have once again. For a counterculture so, artist, yeah. Yeah, and, and on top of that, his wife, uh, whose uh, maiden name was Gail Slopeman, is uh who's still alive and very protective of his legacy from what i hear by the way but uh <laughs> I've, I've heard she may not be too happy if she gets a copy of my book but you know what oh, are you well, gonna do it happens but um she was all she's also she was from a naval uh, intelligence family her dad and and various you know uncles and whatnot she came from a long line of of uh, na career naval officers career na career navy family mm. and um she actually knew Jim Morrison from 20 years earlier. They knew each other as kids through naval officer circles and had actually attended a naval kindergarten together when they were like five years old. Wow. Uh, according to industry legend, she actually once hit Jim over the head with a hammer when they were in <laughs> kindergarten together at five years old. Well, so what were the chances? That adds a whole, that, whole, that, that adds a whole nother weird level of quote unquote coincidence to this story because not not only did you know here you have these two these two people who had known each other 20 years ago and now all of a sudden they both simultaneously arrive in Laurel Canyon he is a larger than life rock star and she as the wife of another larger than life rock star you yeah. know all connected through military intelligence circles mm. and you know what are the odds that that just happened by chance